Hello and welcome back to the craft box. My name is Brenton. Today we are doing some more um, completing the beast moon hunt. Obviously the event is not on at the moment, but that doesn't stop us from crafting a couple of things. So I thought today we would craft up some of the first step pieces um, just because it's always good to have the first step pieces. We have a lot of the Eldritch thread, which um, I'll show you how I get most of it from. Um, we'll just craft up, uh, we'll probably do, uh, three, I think, three or four. Um, we'll just do the first ones that have it, so we're doing the Blooming, Blustery, Brisk, and we'll do one more. One more for fun, four of them, sounds fun. Um, dun -dun -dun -dun. which one is it? Which one is it? Which one's next one? The Infamous, wow. So that looks like the Myth, the Myth Ice storm and life ones so that's fine we can get them started so we will just hop into the beast moon cultivator um it's not in the beast moon cultivator fun fact it's actually in the equipment crafting station so we'll head over there um quickly um but yeah the best way to get all of this thread i will show you in just a second because i have a whole wee little garden set up for them um their robes so there's the blooming <clears throat> nice work, the blustery, the brisk, and the infamous. Look at that, fantastic. Those are the first pieces which we need. Um, eventually we will be crafting all of the end sort of pieces. Um, these ones already just look pretty cool. Um, they're not terrible, which is good. Um, we're just going to quickly lock all of these. I'll um, move them about later. Um, but yeah, the best way to get all of this thread is through um, the beast moon seeds. I've been planting a whole bunch of ones. I've just finished planting a whole bunch of the balance ones, which I have. Um, where did I put them over here? Um, so we have some beast moon blossoms, which are actually ready to harvest, which is good. And as you can see, we get eldritch thread every single time from these, um, sometimes two, sometimes three. Um, so yeah, highly would recommend just getting the beast moon seeds. You can craft them from um, the guy that we were just at before. Uh, let's quickly replant them. So yeah, there's beast moon seeds. There's also the elemental and spirit ones, which, where are they? I have one spirit one. There's a spirit one. Um, and then there's also the balance and death, life, myth, blah, 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 all of the scores. So yeah, they grow really fast, so you don't really have to worry about them. You can also get treasure cards, which speed them up. Um, I will show you in a second. Just, you've got to wait for them to plant. Um, you get these hasty harvests, which um, once they mature, you can cast that and they'll be um, elder. You can only harvest them once at elder. Um, you can't harvest them at mature like other plants, but they speed up really quick. Like, obviously, these ones are already at um, at young, so going super duper quick. Um, but yeah, that's basically how you get all of that. And the more you level up, the more badges you get, the more um, plots you have, I believe. Um, mainly from the winning ones, I think from memory that's what we've got so the more wins you get um or just the more games you compete in the more badges you get obviously we get we have three badges here and i've got three i assume if i get this one then we will have four um but yeah and i assume it just keeps spiraling up from there so those are the way to get them um but otherwise that'll be all for today there will be more of this and we will be crafting all of the rest of the things um and all that sort of stuff but anyway thank you for watching you're into the like and subscribe if you're already subscribed press the wee little bell so you know exactly when i post another video and remember to craft outside the box